a video tutorials by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can quickly create a zigzag design, zigzag custom shape design. Now, it doesn't work in all circumstances, and it, if you use like multiple designs, you won't get the greatest thing. But for a basic zigzag design, just a single shape, it works very well. Now, just go over here to the pen tool, and I'm going to go for shape, no fill, and stroke. That doesn't could use path, of course, is another one. What I'm going to use, I've got, you can see I've got guides, so I'm just clicking there and clicking there. So if you actually want to use the guides, go to View and New Guide Layout, and you can set up a number of guides. I've got 10 by 10 here, so I'm just going to go back again, get rid of that. Okay, just click there and click there, click there and click there. Click there, and you, like I said, use the guides because you can just, I mean, you could obviously just do it because you can just go there, you could use smart guides, but just click over there and click there. And there you have basic design. Now, obviously at this point, it's not a custom shape, so just quickly select all of that and go to edit and define custom shape. Now, once you've done that, what you can do is actually apply the shape. So just quickly go over here to the custom shape tool and again, you've got the same settings here, you've got no fill and you've got stroke, and you can set the options here. I'm just, gonna, oops. just gonna go to here and align, set that, set caps, and set that. So once you actually got that, the custom shape can be applied like that. Now that's an earlier one. So just gonna select the one I've just created and just drag that across, and you can see the design there. Just remove that. So there's the custom shape, and now you can use it multiple times. Now, obviously that's just one custom shape. You can, of course, use the same technique to create other ones. So I'm just going to quickly select that, remove that, and again, just go over the pen tool, and just click there, click there, and using the guides again, but just far more random. It's still a zigzag-like design, and again, there. Straight down to that point, still very zigzag design. And once you've actually got that, again, go there, direct selection, make sense, it's all selected, edit and define custom shape, click OK. Now, when you actually go over here, you can actually select the custom shape tool, apply the shape just like that, stroke, set that those settings as before, like that, and then apply the shape. Now, you can actually use this as a start point for other zigzag shapes as well. So you can go over here and edit and transform pass. Just use perspective. That's quite a good one. So you can just quickly use perspective and you can see what you can do. Just quickly, just drag that there, click OK, and then edit and define custom shape. And again, you've got the custom shape there. Just apply it again. Just drag that down like that. Make a very intense design. You can obviously then, what you can do, just go to the direct selection tool. Oh, I don't want to say that. I can actually select individual parts. I'm just going to drag that up there. Click that one. And so on and so on. Just to create all kinds of zigzag designs. Once you've finished, just select all of the points. Like so they've all selected. And edit and define custom shape. Click OK. And there you have it, quick way of creating multiple zigzag designs, very quick and easy, in Photoshop. Select that one. Like that. And of course, if you actually want to apply it with a fill, you can actually go there, and you can quickly go there and set that to fill. And you can see now, obviously, the red or blue, and so on and so on. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you very much.